Health care and pre-existing conditions were important subjects on the debate stage last night for Vice President Mike Pence and Senator Kamala Harris. Many of you at home might be wondering where President Trump and Joe Biden stand on this issue. Tarek is joining us now with information on both candidates. Tarek? Well, Tom, you know, it's no secret that President Trump wants to repeal the Affordable Care Act, saying a far cheaper and much better plan will replace the Obama-era law. Now, if Obamacare, as it is referred to, is dismantled by the Supreme Court, here's what President Trump says in his executive order about people with pre-existing conditions. On WhiteHouse.gov, the president writes, my administration has been dedicated to providing better care for all Americans. This includes a steadfast commitment to always protecting individuals with pre-existing conditions and ensuring they have access to the high quality health care that they deserve. Access to health insurance despite underlying health conditions should be maintained even if the Supreme Court invalidates the unconstitutional and largely harmful ACA. Multiple researchers who study health care policy have pointed out that the executive order itself doesn't have any legal impact and that if the Affordable Care Act is overturned, Congress would have to reinstate the protections. As for Vice President Joe Biden, he writes on his website, as president, I will protect the Affordable Care Act from these continued attacks. He opposes every effort to get rid of this historic law, including efforts by Republicans and efforts by Democrats. Instead of starting from scratch and getting rid of private insurance, I have a plan to build on the Affordable Care Act by giving Americans more choice, reducing health care costs, and making our health care system less complex to navigate. The Supreme Court will hear arguments in this case on November the 10th. If the Affordable Care Act is overturned, new legislation would be needed to determine what safeguards would exist for people with pre-existing conditions. Tom, Mary.